about that anyway. Hey everybody, make you excited for what gives you back. Oh, uh, it's back for more death end requests. Um, well, well, I'm not sure, I'm not sure if, well before we start, I'm not sure if, if it was a good idea for us to play through like, uh, play through this, uh, well, I might be able to, no, no, I looked at the, uh, I looked at the date for, I looked at when Super Nintendo RPG unlocks, we might be able to play it on Thursday, we have no idea because it said three days and, and there's three days left, it's like, does that mean we can just play it right when it, I don't know, we'll see what happens, anyway, I think, no, I think, yeah, yeah, last we left off, there were, there was nothing else to do, really, and then, I want, I want, we're gonna try to go reality, and, yeah, I don't see anywhere else to go to, so, see a little bit of more points available, that means I pressed up, I pressed the left stick, because I'm used to, pre I'm used to pressing that button to be the, I'm used to, I'm used to pressing the button being in the dash button, but it's actually, uh, RS. Because, well, well, yeah, we had to look, we had to look for, uh, Able to open this door. Open. Okay, never mind. We're gonna fight this guy first. Ready for well, battle. We haven't seen a fight forever, so I think Leave we should. I think we should uh, get those in. All right. All right. Leave it to me. Blast off. Let's go. Huh. to reach 8% or anything, but... Yeah! I, I can't open this door, but... Another thing, too... Um, I believe... I believe 8% is we can actually do the glitch mode thing and get lower. I don't know. We haven't used glitch mode in ages. Yeah! Ha! We just 
droid with a special ability that says...
Why is it slowing down? I didn't think it would go this way. Field? Mr. Enigma, these letters. You can't proceed through here. There must be some kind of a bug. I don't, I don't recall generating a player of all beyond this point. He said bug again? I'll have to check the source code. If I can find where the error is, then you should be able to pass through here without, without a problem. Yeah, I don't think we're ever... We're gonna go to reality and then we have... Uh, Arita, what the hell did you do? Hello? Arita, what the hell did you do? Um. Hello? Arita, what the hell did you do? Huh. Huh? Oh, I fell asleep again. Good thing I set an alarm. Wait, was that? Was, did I hear an alarm for them? I don't know. I wonder. If she do, if she's doing all right, why don't I check in? Sheena, I got some news for you. Is it not she? I've been doing some more digging about whether or not it would be more efficient for us to find your body, or if we'll have to proceed with the ending gauge. <laughs> I have faith in you, Miss Zunashi. Sure thing. So how are you holding up? Everything's good on my end. My script feels a bit loose, but that's about it. She was on screen and she grabbed the edge of her skirt and began swaying. You know, what is it? Why don't you show me something? What? 
You discovered something now place in the game, didn't you? That diary from 2017. I want to take a look inside of it. Same goes for the haunted photo of that park. I've been trying to put two and two together, but some eerie stuff is happening on this side. I thought I'd look into the diary as well. But hey, are you listening? Mr. Nashi, would you mind not trying to give me a heart attack over here? What? What's got you so upset? You asked to see my diary, right? Well, then go ahead. For some reason, a gentle blush appeared on Gina's cheeks, which she pouted as she held the diary open for me. Thanks. I'll hang up for now. Just keep up the good work in there. Got it. I wonder why she felt so pouty. Oh well. Wait, there's something missing through there. I began looking through the pages of the diary, reading the handwritten text as one normally would. But as I flipped through the diary, its contents were becoming more and more unusual. To me, it looked like the work of someone suffering a psychotic breakdown. They're coming. They're coming. The window's broken. There's no light. I've been holding my breath. How did I, how did it know I was here? It's coming. It's coming. Coming. It's coming. It's... It's... Come. Come, 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 come. Don't open the door. Don't open the door. Please. Don't open it. Don't open it. I'll kill you. Tokyo Sagami City. Taka... Takakawa Town. 23 at 9. Sakaki Apartments. 204. Shuzo Kitamura. These scribbles are weird as hell. Hmm. Wait, there's something scribbled in the end here. An address. Is this a real apartment? This journal has been seemingly generated inside of the world's Odyssey. Had an address written in from our world, so I looked it up. To my surprise, it was real. The address's location was approximately 10 minutes away, away from the apartment by, bu by bus. The rush of an adrenaline made me sick to my stomach, but the picture of the park came to mind. There was no telling what I would find, but if it brought me closer to someone, what was going on? I had to make the trip. This is a building, Sakaki Apartments. From the outside, it looked no younger than 60 years old and I was afraid that it would collapse before I could take a look around. Room 204, right. It, it didn't seem like anyone still lived there, but it wouldn't hurt to knock. Behind the front gate was a small courtyard leading an apartment's main entrance. The door was decorated with six heavy glass window panes and an old wooden handle in the center of it. I tried grabbing the handle. Oh, it won't open. Hmm, lock from the outside. I guess no one's home. Can I help you, young man? Oh, sorry. Do you live here? Yes, I'm the landlord here, or used to be. I plan on demolishing the building sometime soon, since no one lives in these apartments anymore. I see. Well, I dropped by today because I was hoping to scale out the building. Oh, you too? Are you a manga artist or a reporter or something? I don't want to be rude, but... I guess it is what it is. Lately, we had a lot of visitors looking to document other people's misfortunes. But since I, I plan on demolishing it anyway, it probably doesn't matter. Misfortunes? Um, did something happen here? Oh, I thought you came because you knew. Knew what? Oh, my apologies. Sorry about that. No, I don't mind. Sadly, the other day, there was a murderer. A murderer? Yes, once the body was discovered, the police force taped everything off, and then came the flood of reporters. It was all over the news. Worst of all, this wasn't the killer's only stop. It sounded like there were only victims in some of the nearby apartments. A breaking and entering situation. The guy was a serial killer. However, since this place was pretty run down, and people were moving out left and right anyway, the victim was one of the last tenants there. Here. It was a straw that broke the camel's back from a building. No one was going to move in here. Word gets around pretty quick, you know. With that said, 
I decided to sell the lamb. If you want to skip around, then you've got 10 minutes. If it's too dark, feel free to switch to any of the lights on. Thank you. You are very kind. No problem at all. The building's getting torn down next month anyway. Here's the memories gone in a flash. I gotta hit the bank, so I'll be on my way. Feel free to check the place out. Oh, and one last thing. When you're done, do me a favor and lock the doors. You don't have to wait for me to return. Oh, sure thing. Thanks again. Landlord girl her lips into a weak smile and left the belt another word. I had assumed that the previous tenants belonged as I cleaned from, from the room so there was no threat for theft of what or what not. I managed to pry the poorly designed door open and walked into the stale, musty hallway. Okay, we're gonna take care of this stuff another another day. Hope you guys enjoyed this and don't forget to subscribe for more videos and as always I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.